Ooh, the main, main event. event. Here we go. Yuki Yamanaka. Versus Juan Pablo Salazar. Versus Juan Pablo Salazar out of Montreal. So Yuki's a local fighter. Most people know who he is. He's, uh, he's made a good name for himself. He's fighting out of a uh, new era of combat sports. And again, you know, they have some great fighters and great skills and great coaches. So Big time, yeah. The whole region here, Ottawa Gatsino's got uh, quite the level of talent. As we're so. seeing here, uh, Juan Pablo Salazar making his way down and entering the ring. He's got a record of 9-6 and six fighting out of, out of Academy Frontenac. Tell us a little bit about Academy Frontenac. They got some, some aggressive fighters. Yeah, they got some great aggressive fighters because they have like, they have an aggressive coach, Samuel Samuel uh, Diaz, right here, uh, uh, cornering him. And he's, uh, he was one of my training partners for a long time, Samuel. Really, yeah? In Montreal, yeah, when he, when he used to train in Montreal on a regular basis. Wait, wait, which dojo were you guys training at? We're training at uh, Gamma. Oh, yeah, Janina's. Uh, yeah, 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 Phil Janina's gym. And uh, Sam was there for a long time while I was, when I pretty much first started my MMA career. Wow. And uh, training with, uh, you know, to get to with uh, Fabio Holanda and doing Muay Thai and boxing with a uh, few of the top guys there. Sam was a really, really good, a good training partner to train with. And he's a great fighter as well. So now we've turned uh, turn both of these. And I reached out to him a little while ago. And he's, uh, you know, he's brought out some fighters from Frontenac. Frontenac Gym. It's been, it's been a really great time. And we're seeing uh, Yuki and yeah, fighting out of the blue here. corner with a record of nine and six and representing and a the ring. Jumps over the ropes because he's cool. Salazar. Super cool. I love the purple ankle dance. And fighting, fighting out of the red corner with a record of 15 and 10. And, and we're like representing no, New Era Combat it's Sports. Classic, yeah, he's got a Yuki! He's you probably making a statement. America! Fashion statement. He might start a new trend. <laughs> Who knows? He could. I think that Yuki could start a trend. And of course, the white crew. Now, tell us a little bit about uh, y Yuki Yamanaka. He, he fought here last time. He fought uh, against, uh, I forgot his name, out of Quebec City. Oh, but the, yes. the, the, there was some, dare I say, controversy. Yeah, the fight, of... the fight was very close. I, I think it was, a, it was a great fight, though. It, I, I don't want to s speculate as to what happened. I, sure, sure. I, it, you know, with me being the promoter, it's hard, hard yeah, to Yeah, well, you know, I, I'll, I'll say, I'll say, I Go totally ahead. respect that. There, there, there was some fans thought, hey, the decision there was was, was rather, wrong. Yeah. yeah, was rather wrong. But these things, I mean, it's, it goes to the judge's decision. They're assessing based on a certain a set of criteria, and, and it's a combat sport. You know, anything can happen. And, uh, anyways, I, I think he's coming in into this fight wanting, obviously, to win and, and to redeem himself. Yeah, Yuki, and you know what's really fun about watching Yuki is he's just so intense when it comes to um, when it comes to the Y crew. I love watching him do his wide crew. I think it's very, very enter I mean, entertaining and it's fun to watch. It's very, it's a respectful uh, way to, you know, to to get in the ring, and I, I think that he shows that elegantly with his hundred percent, hundred percent. I'll go as far as saying, if this was pro wrestling, his wide crew alone is worth admission. Absolutely, yeah. Because <laughs> because the level of performance that he gives, I mean, people right now are, are watching this attentively because they know he's gonna take it to a whole different level, unlike anywhere. He, he, like, this is his value-added proposition here. That's exactly the, what it is. You know, th this is what he brings, and this is why Yuki Yamanaka is one of the, not only is a great technical fighter all around, lots of heart, lots of technique, he knows how to perform for the crowd. He does, and he does a great job. And again, it goes back to that skill level and the coaches, right? So, you know, he follows his coaches wherever they are, and that's why he that's why he is how he is. That's why he is he, as good as he is. And just watching this wide crew is really, really enjoyable. It's it's like watching, you know, a, a play or uh, just art in general, really. He's an artist, uh, you know, when it comes to when it comes to the wide crew in the ring. It's like ballet. Absolutely, it's yeah. psychological warfare. Yep. And I, I believe he's, uh, he's a samurai-esque. Narrative. Well, he is part Japanese, right. half, half Japanese, right. I believe. Yeah. I remember waiting the, for I, it. They're waiting for it. Waiting for it. They're waiting for it. Is he throwing a bow and arrow? There it it's is. Coming. There it is. Uh oh, what's Salazar oh. going to do? He's hey, Salazar, what are you going to do, brother? He should catch it. What you going to do when Yuki Yamanaka? Salazar. I love it. Salazar's not selling it. He ain't buying it. 
He didn't buy it. You can't have it. Oh, Salazar. Beautiful. Salazar. Oh, beautiful. I love it. Such a beautiful white crew. Well Salazar. done. And I love the way that they, it's traded back and forth yeah. between, between both fighters. You see what I mean? That's what I love about it. The temperature in the Sala San Marco just, just went, up went up 15 degrees out here. Absolutely. And I wish, I wish, I wish I was able to, you know, find the time to learn my own white crew. I just, I, just, I just don't have the time, and I wish I would. Yeah, 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 you can. You're in the building, throw the team. <laughs> yeah, you, right. you can do it, brother. <laughs> you know, the first, my first Muay Thai fight was yeah. that way. I just walked around and, you know, sealed the ring as, as all my fighters do. Right. And the opponent that I was fighting did a white crew, and he threw, he threw a bow at me. Wow. Like, I, sorry, he threw an arrow at me with bow okay. and arrow. And uh, what did I, you do? I, apparently, I was supposed to catch it and break the arrow. I, I didn't know. I just stood there and just smiled at him and, and bow, did a traditional bow and, and fought him. Well, who won that match? He he actually won the fight, ah. even though even though I believe I beat him up. Yeah, well. If you watch the fight, he was rocked. He was rocked so many times. But anyway, it was more about you know him throwing many knees. Here we go. Action started. This is A class. Catches the leg. Oh and Juan Pablo sweeps him after the catch. Salazar well ain't well wasting well time. Well job done. Well done. Good low kick. Beautiful low kick. That's it. Oh, they both look like they're ready to go. I know this is going to be action packs for action pack for the next three rounds. This is the main event, folks. Oh! oh! Knocked him back. The aye, the aye, aye. Juan Pablo the face, knocked him back down. But, why, but you know what? He got right back up. He My got, God. Academy Frontenac is losing their mind right Yamanaka, now. Yamanaka got right back up. He's fine. He's, 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 he's still in this fight. He's, sir, he's, he's totally in this fight. He's totally he's in still he's in this fight. But, but now, Salazar, momentum, brother. See, there's a sweep. There's a sweep. No, he missed it. But now Juan Pablo is now. He's got this confidence, you see? Yep. Now he's got the confidence to, to continue fighting and try to knock him out. He got that knee to the face and he knocked him down, but Yamanaka got back up like it was nothing. Yamanaka's got that experience. He's fought 15, 15, he's 15 fought 18 25 times. times. 20, 25 times. That's a lot of experience. There it is, good kicks back and forth. Excellent his knee. His opponent's only fought, I mean, his opponent's got a lot of experience as well. He's fought 15 times, but. Uh, Both upgraded to open class, which means no headgear, no shin pads. This is a great fight. Oh, a great fight. Yamanaka, very dangerous with those kicks. Good cross. But I tell you, Salazar is aggression here. Fighting with a lot of aggression, tactically unleashing it. That intermittent aggression. These guys, by Salazar. they're doing a great job putting on the, putting on a show for these guys. You know, the, the open class is always exciting to watch because of, because of the experience they have. That's it. A good inside kick by, by Salazar. Ooh. Straight jab by Salazar. Action, just action pack. Action pack the last three fights. Yeah, good oh, high kick. Oh, he catches the, the catch that kick. Follows up with his own kick right to the head. Yeah, man, I can't have it. Locked up in the clinch, throws a nice inside knee. Thirty seconds left here. Salazar's oh, good, oh, good flying flag knee, by flag knee right by on Salazar. Yamanaka, right to Yamanaka. Oh, Yamanaka's got that clinch. Salazar with this intermittent burst of. Of rage. And the referee breaks him up. They got, they got a few seconds left. See what they can do. Oh, oh spinning back fist. Salazar's relentless. Good knee by Yamanaka. There it is. <laughs> Great job. That first round. What first a round match. over. What a My match. goodness. First round is over. First round. Heroes Combat League, La Casa Nostra. La Casa Nostra. Oh, shit. La, La, La Casa Nostra. La My goodness. Casa Nostra. <laughs> What I'm losing my fight. mind out here. This is going to be a great. And the next two rounds are going to be insane. I can't. I can't even tell you how good this first round was. Man, this is this has been awesome. And we got two more rounds potentially. Two, two more, more rounds, rounds to go. Left here. Uh, now, what do you think, Crew Jeff is telling Yamanaka there in the corner? Telling him. I think he, I think he's I you know what, like I said it all depends on the fighter if that if that was me 
Uh, he, Jeff looks like he's pretty calm right now, so just probably tell him, you know, great job, a little more, a little more aggression, try to stay off the ropes. Um, your kicks are really good, but I would get your jab off a little bit more. And uh, I think that he was doing good in the clinch. He's had, he had the clinch nice and tight. Here we go, round two. Oh, good. Oh, that Pablo keeps trying to catch that leg. Good high kick by, by Yamanaka. Juan Pablo Salazar versus Yuki Yak. Yamanaka here. Oh, good high kick. What a kick by Yamanaka. Coming that in aggressive. Good. Right cross, left knee. Knees to the body, good eyes, knee attempt, and sweep, sweep attempt. Good, good counter by Pablo. You gotta watch out for Juan Pablo Salazar. Any moment now, he'll unleash something. Very good fighters, very, very, very good fighters. Very Cross. Good skills, that right hand is dropping a little bit for Salazar though. Good overhand right by Yamanaka. Just missed it a little bit. Oh, oh, oh good oh, up. Upward elbow from the inside by Pablo. What ruthlessness Salazar has. Easy. Good knees, good knees by Yamanaka. Fight this fight, this here. fight is amazing. Those knees by Yamanaka were crazy. Good, Total nice and tight. Stop action here at Heroes Combat League. As always, That's the main event. The Salazar, main event. Yamanaka. There it is. The right hand by Salazar. That spinning upward, upward elbow was unreal. There it is. He's messing up his hair, though. I think it might be dangerous for him now. Don't mess up my hair. <laughs> Yuki, Yamanaka, he's got to get that head, out of, get to keep his head out of that clinch. Looks like Yamanaka's bleeding from the nose there. Looks like he is. Yeah, a little bit of blood coming down from there. Good clinch. Good clinch. Nice knee. What, what does what a, Yamanaka need to do against this, this yeah. brawling Salazar? Good elbow nice from Yuki. Set. Pablo keeps him up against the ropes. What a match, what a match. Who's the matchmaker for this show? Good isn't, job. Isn't it in the build, the throw, got the hip. Go! Oh, Yamanaka. Yamanaka. Wow. And wasted time kick. out here. That's it. Hashtag Yamanaka. These guys are putting on the best show of the night. This is definitely, the, oh, he comes Salazar. down with the right hand. Salazar, Salazar, Salazar follows up. Oh, good knees by, go. by Yamanaka in the corner. They're both exhausted now. They're doing a great job. Crew Jeff Harrison's losing his mind He is out losing there. his mind. Popping and locking. That's a good low kick. Oh, good oh. high kick by Yamanaka. That's it. Pablo's got to come back with some counters. Good uppercut, left hook. Whoa! Yamanaka's high kick. That's Yamanaka a great high kick. Yamanaka is unleashing out here. Unleashing the power of that kick. That high kick was perfect. Nailed it. The timing was unreal in that kick. There it is again. Pablo's trying to catch that kick, but Pablo's exhausted. Oh, he's my tired. God. There it is. Pablo looked like he's going down very quickly. Let's see if Yamanaka can finish it off. The structural engineer is tactically bringing no, down this building. He's again. bringing the building down. He's bringing Salazar down there step it is. by step. Pablo's turning Big around. Elbow. He should be facing him a little bit more. Pablo, and another one. There it is. Oh, oh, Yuki's. Oh. oh, there it is. My God. Nice, beautiful. Round is over. One more round to go. Tactically, second by second, breaking down the tough and wild and relentless Salazar. This has been a great match. This is round number two, folks. Imagine that. The main event here, open class, 155 pounds, Yamanaka versus Salazar. Yamanaka looks like he, he looked like he knew that, that he was hurt and he was, uh, you know, he was just attacking, you know, relentlessly. And even though he was exhausted, he still was attacking. That great high kick. Yes. You know, to set him up. To set that. him up. Yeah, he set him up with that kick, with that a great high kick with a jab. And uh, but but you know what, Pablo looked like he was tiring out. He looked like he was being overwhelmed. And I think that Yamanaka was doing a great job. And I think that he's got to. If he continues that way in the third round, I think he's going to take this fight. No doubt. This could be. This could be the round here. This could be the round. Yamanaka's looking confident. Last round. Oh, there you go. They're giving they it to Yamanaka. It. They called it. They Salazar's called the fight. out. Salazar is out, and Yamanaka wins the fight by, I believe, the, the corner threw in, threw, in the, threw in the towel. Great effort by Great Salazar. Effort. What a warrior. But it's going to Yuki Yamanaka, a Yuki. new era combat new sports. Era combat sports. What a yeah. match to build the throw kick. Exactly what I was saying. They bring out the great fighters, the coaches, they know what they're doing. And they really, really put on a great show for the crowd. What a tactician. Unbelievable. What an engineer. He's out here. He is engineering Absolutely. his victory. <laughs> he was.
I wonder if he's got a degree. He's, got, he's probably got a degree in Muay Thai. He probably does. does. A, a degree in Muay Thai and, <laughs> and engineering. That's right. Sounds like a win-win if you ask me. No kidding. What a great fight. That was so exciting to watch. You know who really won out here? The fans, the Hero <laughs> Combat League fans who came out. And the winner of this main event contest. A great match for this great As a event. result of a referee stoppage, fighting out of the red corner, Yuki. A beautiful win for Yamanaka and it was good there. Redemption for his last, his last uh, show. Even though he fought really well the last fight, he just he didn't he didn't get the win. And uh, I'm just gonna go up and say a couple words. Yeah, right man, up. do it, brother. The build the throw, Khatib is going in the ring now to interview the. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, another round of applause for these amazing fighters tonight. Big shout out to Juan Pablo Salazar from Academy Frontenac. What a warrior, what a brawler, that relentless spirit. Very entertaining fighter. Wow, wow what, what a great, great way to end the show. show. Main event, that was crazy. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the show. Thank you so much for the support. We'll be back in, uh, in it look like probably September. Look forward to the, uh, YouTube, the YouTube channel. The YouTube, YouTube fights will be up in the next couple of weeks. weeks. And, and uh, you can tell your friends about it. And our next show, like I said, will be August, September. And uh, just go to Facebook, and you'll see all the, uh, all the information there. Thank you very much, guys. Have a great night. Make sure you tip your staff. Tip the way staff. Thank you very much. Guys, have a great night. Heroes Combat League, La Casa Nostra. Thank you all for watching. See you next time.